Praise God. I told you he got me, he got me going. And so let's continue to go. So basically, another thing. God was saying, Deanna, there's too many of my people. There's too many people, period, dying at the hands of fake love. Mm -mm -mm. We all know it well because here's the deal. Lately, for the last two, to, actually two to five years, it's been an increase in people killing each other. Whether it's a woman kill a man or a man kill a woman in the name of love. No, in the name of fake love. Well, I'm going to school you for a few minutes about what real love is. First of all, real love was like what Jesus did on that cross. He came to save the lost. Real love don't beat you. Real love don't curse you. Real love don't mistreat you. Real love don't cheat on you. Real love don't spit in your face. Real love, d you get the drift. We've, a society, have got comfortable in being mistreated. Women calling each other bees. Y'all get on my nerve with that. <laughs> God, I know you was going to make me say it, y'all. You made me tell everything. Last time, I got, I almost got in trouble. I almost went to jail. And believe it or not, it was while being saved about maybe eight, nine years ago. That's when I was married. And um, might have been longer than that, y'all. 2012, something like that. And I never forget the, the the next door neighbor. I don't know what was going on her between her and my ex husband. I don't know, and I don't want to know, you know. But I I kept I was working all the time, and I never forget. She can't put a note on the door, and she knew I was home. So I was like, that's a little bold, cause you like just ignore stuff. I'm 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 good at ignoring you, especially if you're silly. Let a clown be a clown. Don't go to the circus. <laughs> what? I ain't paying no ticket. So, anywho, that day, though, she must have caught she must have caught me on the wrong side. And I was wrong. Let me just go ahead and say that because one thing I want Christians to do is, you, if you're a Christian, you can't operate like like the world. So, anywho, I, all I was trying to be nice to her, I was like, young lady, please stop putting. She said, B, boy, I don't know what it is about that word, y'all. I hit that girl so hard, and she was younger than me. I hit her so hard, I cried. After it was all over, because she couldn't handle it. I already knew that. Well, even though she was younger, stronger, I'm trying to tell y'all something. When somebody, a child of God, we got we got some strength. I don't know where we get it from. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. So, anywho, I'm just telling you how that word irks me. Good thing I didn't go to jail that day because of the Caucasian people across the street. They say, that girl always messing with that girl, that woman, and that woman will never say nothing. I guess today she say. You know, I know not today. <laughs> not saying I was right, cause like I said, I was wrong, and I never since that day I've never laid my hands on anybody. Even when they try to, I just walk away. But I'm saying this to say, the enemy has put so much, even in the um the little kid games. Now here it is, we're playing the old Nintendo because my daughter is very, you know, she doesn't let Austin just look at everything, and he don't even know what YouTube is all the way, meaning that he's not. You know, he's still pure. She doesn't let him listen to that stuff that most children listen to. Because I'm still trying to find out how these little kids can shake their butt and do all kind of stuff but don't know no scripture. Okay, Deanna. They don't want that one. So, anywho, society have put all this violence and anger on YouTube, on TikTok, lust, everything. Got people so angry. Oh, thank you, Lord. The reality shows. Housewives of this. Housewives of that. The this of that. Cussing each other out, fussing, fighting. Does anybody understand what's happening? You've been induced to provoke you to anger because things are spiritual. I'm going to say it again, everything's spiritual. How about everything out of spirit? Y'all crazy. Point blank in the story. I, I used to, I used to kind of not, you to go, oh, well, maybe they're right. Maybe it, no. God told me everything is spiritual. Either the natural or the supernatural. It's all spirits. You are a spirit. Read your Bible. Your spirit. That's why these people out here talking about their gods. You ain't no gods, though. Oh, anyway. Provoking people to anger. Getting people to settle for being mistreated. What am I saying? We've got comfortable in being mistreated. Man. <laughs> Especially these silly women. Quit letting men beat on you. Because if they beat you now, they'll kill you later, which I rebuke in the name of Jesus. God says, too many getting taken out in this hour, saved and unsaved. 
because you don't know how to deal with your problems. And I'm going to tell you, just like my mom used to tell me, most of you curse because you don't have the words to say because, number one, you ain't got no education because you didn't go to school. Or, number two, you don't read. So the first thing come out your mouth is a curse word. And y'all don't understand what curse words, how powerful they are. They are literally curse words. You're cursing somebody. Yes, you're cursing somebody. Even spelling. They say spelling bee. What do you think spelling comes from? Cast a spell. Y'all going to learn that wordplay. Y'all going to learn everything is about wordplay in this hour. Listen to it. The vocabulary. We be shunned for so long, but God is, uns God is exposing the enemy. Every little dirty trick, every little dirty antic. God says too many people are dying by the hands of so-called fake love. Real love will respect you. Real love won't talk about you. Real love won't expose you, so say on Facebook. Real love don't do. The first time you see any of that foolishness, bye. See, you wouldn't want to be you. But he fine. But she fine. But they got money. They got a good credit score. I don't care if you was a millionaire. And y'all might not believe me. When I was in California, I got some, I, I don't even know what to say. And I wouldn't even save like I am. And I knew, no, thank you. I can give you this. I can, No, thank you. And it wasn't the, at the beginning I said it. Soon as I saw the red flag, I was out of there. As a matter of fact, today, if I see a red flag, even for a friend or a family member, I'm out of there. Bye, I see you. Wouldn't want to be you. Because them red flags mean stop. Don't go any further. Something's wrong. Pray for that person. They will hurt you. Y'all wonder how people are getting killed. Most people that are killed are killed by people they know. When you see the red flags, go away. Stop. It, don't, it doesn't make you a weak person. It makes you strong. I see you acting fool. I'm going to act fool with you. The devil is a lie. Too many people dying, God says, by the hand of fake love. Well, it's better than no love. The devil is a lie. That's one thing I agree with that spirit on. I get me a goldfish and a puppy. I ain't going to be looking around seeing what's, what, what's wrong with you. I, I think the most I can say for that, and that's probably why God got me speaking on it, is when I was married. That man almost killed me that day. If it had not been for his daughter, he was gone. I know I've, I've seen the spirit of rage close up. Nobody can't tell me nothing. I just knew I was going to die that day. When he pulled up that knife, and one of my good knives, when he, my own knife on me, when he pulled up that knife, and he, he was finna, I don't know what made his daughter open that garage door, because he, he was in the garage beating the heck out of me. My head literally was swole this big, and I'm not exaggerating. I didn't want to press charges. Can you believe that? The DA kept coming to my house every day, throwing the pictures. Do you see what he did? You did you? See? I've never seen that happen. That's how bad I looked, apparently. I was beat so bad, I didn't even know I was beat that bad. I'm going somewhere with this. Let me continue. If it had not been for his daughter, and I know God sent that little girl. She said, Daddy. And he was still, she said, Dad. And when she said, Daddy, the second time, I saw something. I didn't understand spiritual warfare like I do now. But I saw something relief off of him. And, and because I thought I was dead. When, he, when she looked at his eyes, he, he, I guess he, he, it kind of got to him. Oh, wait, that's my daughter. What am I doing? And that's when he dropped the knife. That's what saved my life. But let me tell you what I did after that. I said, you got to go. And six months later, he tried to come back. Can we get remarried? I said, no. I'm a one-timer. You tried to kill me. And although I care about you, I love me more. I know y'all don't care about this subject, most of y'all. Because most people don't care unless it's them. God got on here. God wanted me to get on here. To tell you to pray for people that you know that are in abusive relationships, whether it is mentally, physically, emotionally. Too many people are getting killed. You see the signs, but and this this generation, y'all think if he beat you, he love you. If he mistreat you, he love you. If he talk to you nasty, he love you. If he curse you out, he he love you. That is psychological disturbance of the mind. That's not even real. That's a delusion from an illusion to thinking that he's a good guy or even a woman. A woman can be abusive as well. It is not gender. That spirit, that spirit is not gender, <laughs> you know, 
to one gender. Hallelujah. I say hallelujah. Be by yourself until God sends someone that's going to love you and respect you. Hold on. Even people of God. I'm going here. I've met several men of God. God said you my wife, this and that. And then try to treat somebody crazy. They got the right one. Then try to put me like, and I'm going here today. Because I hope, I hope a couple of them listening. Because then they'll know why I just disappeared. When you couldn't control me, you tried to manipulate me. And when you couldn't manipulate me, you tried to put me down. Or oh, you act like a man. No, I'm not a man, babe. I'm all a woman, but I'm just strong. So strong that I'm not going to let you hurt me. Mm -hmm. and, 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 and try to break me down to nothing so you can control me. The devil is a liar. The devil is a liar. Love you this year. Take care of you this year. Because, and that's another thing, when you learn to love yourself, you, 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 you actually teach people how to treat you. You're not a dog. And as a man or woman, don't let nobody treat you that way. You deserve respect. You deserve love. Real love and real respect. Because let me tell you something. A real woman can handle it by herself. But a real man won't let her. That's for you women that pay men to be with y'all. That's for you women that let them play games and you pay all the bills while you go to work because you just want a, a breath in britches, not even a real man. You heard me. And vice versa. Some of y'all men got women. You didn't read Proverbs 31, apparently. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm touching some subjects today. Some subjects that people don't like to touch because they, ooh, they hurt. Mm -hmm. And I've been there. I, I, I know. I, be, I, I did it all too until I got a clue. Even men and women of God quit letting people mistreat you, even through Facebook. You see, when you throw something, I catch it. And when I catch it, I'm supposed to respect you? The devil is. I'm supposed to think, what? You are a beautiful king, and a handsome king, and you are a beautiful queen. God made you in his image. Walk it, talk it, live it. I didn't say be arrogant, but love yourself. Learn to love yourself because I see what them spirits are doing. Them spirits are trying to oppress people, suppress people, and depress people, and that's when they overtake you. You see, when you got all them spirits, you don't love yourself, then anybody or anything will come in and overtake you. That's what's really happening. Been that, done that too. Hallelujah. I say hallelujah. So, I think I got one more video to do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's like that today. It's like that today. Both guns loaded. Loaded. I'm talking about in the spirit. Let me clarify that. <laughs> and y'all know why. <laughs> she said she got both guns loaded. I wish she went. <laughs> Smith and Wilson in the spirit. <laughs> oh, y'all made me laugh. All right. God bless you. God keep you. I know what time it is. Roll our soldiers for that is truly who we are. God bless.